Is this your Jane Doe? Yeah. Came in two nights ago. Hasn't come round yet. She's a fighter, though. I've lost plenty with injuries less than hers. Five broken ribs, lung punctured in two places, ruptured spleen. What'd you do, get hit by a truck? Yeah, she left some nightclub with her boyfriend. Uh, looks like a gang jumped them. Left her lying outside the club. They found him several blocks away. He's in the room three doors down. So, what do you think? 50-50. Come on, doctor. There's a coffee and donut downstairs need your attention. That was one freaky dream. This a... Uh, hospital? What the hell happened? Oh my god. I'm dead? No, 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 I don't want to be dead. Things were just starting to work out. Louis and I were just... Oh my god. Louis. What happened to us? Huh? What the hell are you? A bit short for the Grim Reaper, aren't ya? You're not dead, Jennifer. But if you don't be quiet and listen to me, you soon will be. My name is... Well, let's say you can call me Scree. I've been sent to find you, to show you some very important things and to enlist your assistance. Right. Well, Scree... Glad I'm not dead. But first you better explain how come I'm looking down on myself. She is creeping me out. Your corporeal form, the one still lying there, is very weak, close to death perhaps, but not yet lost. That is only part of you. The other part, your spirit, that's you. I set it free from your body so that we could talk. In fact, now that it's free, you'll find you can travel to places you've never even imagined. 